Well, storytelling is like the oldest form of communication. So it's, it's always mattered. It was like a big white blank canvas where I could just like throw color at it and just make it my own. So this is a collection of all the floral sketches I've done for a year. And yeah, that kind of was a therapeutic process for me as well to just look at all the flowers that I'd drawn throughout the year and just put a meaning and symbolism to them. And that's kind of what prompted me to create the flower mural for Vancouver Mural Festival. So each flower in the mural has meaning. It relates back to a memory or an experience in my own life. The top left corner of the mural is, those are flowers from my childhood. The moon flowers were ones where they would just like litter the alleyways and creep all over the fences and I remember thinking they were such a resilient flower because they're just everywhere. The sunflower is kind of reminiscent of my brothers as well because growing up we had a small little sunflower in the yard that grew up in height with us. If the ones up top represent the past, these ones below symbolize the present. So I really wanted to focus on like the crocuses because those are a spring flower that just like buds and shoots out of the ground, like out of nowhere. And snowdrops for me represent resilience, strength, a good kind of stubbornness and growth in dark times. There's a lot of hidden morbid beauty in the mural. Corner of the mural, it shows the stages of the dandelion going from growth to death. I kind of wanted to incorporate that evolution of flowers throughout all the different images. So some of the flowers are living and thriving and some of them are dying and falling away. The two spirit creatures, they represent the concept of duality and just how everything in life, there are so many opposites. There's life and death and order and chaos. Duality is a balance of everything and uniting those two opposites and making something beautiful out of it. I knew I wanted to put stars into the little constellation bunny up top. I added the Big Dipper and the Little Dipper inside as a final detail. So the middle of the mural is actually kind of just like all these leaves and flowers just like flowing through each other. And that's supposed to kind of be like an unknown future where the past and present collide where the forces of duality meet in the middle and conjure up something magical. Thank you to Vancouver Mural Festival for giving me the opportunity and to all the curators and people on staff who were helpful throughout the whole process. For sure to my lovely volunteers who took the time out of their day to come. I'm super grateful that you came to help. And of course to Vanita, my assistant painter, who like went through everything with me and from start to finish was there through the whole process.